yeah, you pay a lot of money for everything. Um, books usually cost me anywhere from 300 to 450 or so. Um, the earlier you go, the better, the more likely you are to get used books, which are cheaper. Um, you can sell back your books um, at the end of the term, but for like two bucks a book, which you don't really make like any profit, you might as well just keep them. Um, a lot of people get their books off of Amazon.com, which is like a lot cheaper, but um, a lot of times there are different versions of the book that they use in class. So like when the teachers like turn to page 38, their book, like their page 38 is really like page 12 or something because it's like a big coloring book or... Um, so I usually just get the the books in the bookstore so they're the same size as the teacher's edition. And I'm currently not on a meal plan, but was last year. Um, and that's like $500 a term to eat really greasy food that's really bad for you every day. And slowly watch you and everyone around you gain a little bit of pounds, which is kind of fun because, you know, physical form changing due to fatty foods. Nah, it wasn't that great. It sucked. I hated eating on campus. It's just grease. They pile, like, grease and lard and throw, like, a noodle in there and call it, like, something else, and that's, like, your food. Yay! It's like eating out every day. It costs, like, $5 for every meal you get. So it's really expensive. So I'll be paying, that's part of my student loans, I'll be paying my um, fat consumption off when I graduate. I kind of pay for laundry because I have a laundry machine and dryer and takes up a lot of electricity um, but I didn't last year for the dorms um, instead last year you'd go down to the laundry room and um, wait for like two hours until you could get like one machine 